What's going on guys? Uh, I've got a little bit of time today. The sun is out. It's like 73 degrees outside. Um, some plans of the build have changed uh, as far as the undercoating goes. So today I'm going to be testing out. Uh, I've got Raptor uh, truck bed coating and I've got their tough undercoating. I think both will be a good um, option, uh, but we're going to put them head to head and see how they react to a little bit of testing. Cool. Another difference is that this um, undercoating was $14.99 or $15.99, and then the truck bed coating was $18.99 or $19.99, so it's definitely um, a little more expensive, but I think I like it better. I think it's, it's more uniform. I think it's going to be more durable, um, but we'll see. I think I'm going to do so, a little bit of torture testing just to see see which I like better um, and which is more durable. Allegedly, the undercoating is more rubberized um, and should have a bit of sound deadening, but I, 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 don't, I don't hear a difference. Um, I don't know. This also definitely requires, I don't, yeah, you can kind of see it. It's not quite as um, thick of a coating. I think if I were to do this one, I'd I'd put three coats on just because you can still see the underlying metal, whereas this one is uniform and thick. So, yeah, I'm gonna go try to scratch the crap out of these. These are only these are only an hour old, so they should harden some more over the next few hours. But I don't want to wait down the hill good job all right already this one has opened up so not um, this is the the <coughs> undercoating it's already opened up Why is it open? so I think that answers the durability test the bed liner is definitely more <coughs> durable So this one's kind of chipped. And this one's flaking off completely. All right, so clearly not super scientific testing because we didn't um, etching primer them or you know do a whole bunch of coatings or even wait the full four hours to let them fully dry. But um, I feel like this is giving me a pretty good idea of what I want to do. This one's like chipping off and uh, didn't have any any extra durability for the can started spraying out with just dragging it or rolling it down the driveway dragging this one through the rocks has kind of made it i guess not necessarily chip in big chunks like this one but you know smaller so at least you could repair that easier so i think this is what i'm gonna go for all right, see you tomorrow.